it's a small, it's a small setup. Um, I, I just, I just hit the ten-year mark. I'm still really small. I've got a lot to learn. I, I break things all the time, but I'm working on it. So I'm going to do, I'm going to do an implosion pendant. And when you're doing pendants from tubing, I'm going to work on the outside of this bubble. Melt it all down, float it in. I'm going to pull this bubble off and flip it around. So all the detail is going to be on the inside. To make things even more interesting, what's neat is um, you're working with gold and silver, and you're working with glasses that contain the silver, your flame chemistry has a lot of a uh, big part to play in things. Because if you have too much propane, an overabundance of propane, your flame is called reducing. And that will actually draw silver molecules and other metal molecules to the surface of the glass. And if you have a lot of oxygen, it's called oxidizing, and that will actually do the opposite, which will kind of around here. I'm using this clear, dotting it on, I'm going to encapsulate this fuming. So when I melt this down, or I implode it, these dots are going to stick them up, be magnified, they're going to be covered with this blend of silver and gold. So as you melt all these dots down, what happens is the dots melt into the glass first. And they kind of smooth out. Now they're all smooth and melted to it. And you can kind of, I don't know if you can see through the backwards, but you can start to see what's going on there. They're starting to implode into the glass. So as I melt this down more, I'm going to work from the center kind of gather it up. What happens is these dots, they can't go this way, they can't push out this way anymore. So we're going to push in to the glass now. They're going to come up and push up into the design. A lot of patience is required. Just gently taking the rotation between my hands uh, off from each other. Kind of put a little bit of drag on my left hand. And I got that design nicely sunk in there now. We're going to do the back of the pendant. 
going to go back with black. It's really going to make these colors pop. So basically what I'm doing, I'm just smearing this color across the glass. I'm just taking it really slow. I'm letting the heat heat it up and get it nice and melty and hot and wet. And I'm just going to let kind of let it do its own thing. I'm not going to push it too, too hard. So that excess all. Get this nice and smooth and melted. You can see the marvering pad, the graphite, lets me kind of shape the glass and roll it and work with it to get it where I need it to be size-wise. I can't just use my palm. Up, which way wants to be down. Big rock star, star stand. Stamp it. And it's done. That's Perfect. it. Hi, Wayne McDermott, Rockstar Glassworks. I am a borosilicate flame worker or a lamp worker. Uh, I've been blowing glass for 10 years. I just demonstrated how to do a uh, tubing implosion pendant. I'd say my uh, specialty is mostly jewelry, doing beads and uh, small pieces. Uh, I do a lot of implosion work, like that pendant, but just different sizes of stuff. And I also uh, do a lot of hollow stuff with vases. Look us up on Facebook, Rockstar Glassworks on Facebook. Like me.